Good day, Pinoy Clicksers and Mixers. Welcome back to the channel. And for this video, we're going to look at arguably the best figure of 2022. And I'm talking about Marvel's Spiral. Let's go! Okay, so we're looking at the Uncanny X-Men Marvel Legends Marvel's Spiral action figure and as you can see this is a mint in sealed box uh, figure okay i've been holding on to this figure since the start of the year uh, only now have i decided to unbox it okay i was trying to keep it mint because this is the arguably as i said best figure uh, that marvel legends released for 2022 okay so we're gonna check it out and see whether that is indeed uh, something that we can claim for the figure. Okay, so this particular uh, character, Marvel Spiral, is of course the lieutenant of Mojo in the Mojoverse okay, and a villain to Longshot. Okay, so she is the Sorceress Swords because... She has a lot of swords, so you can see already uh, a bunch of accessories included in the figure. We have the illustration here at the front, and then at the back, we can see uh, the set that it comes with. Okay, so Wolverine, Dark Phoenix, Longshot, Multiple Man, Avalanche, and of course, Spiral. Okay, so take a look at that pose with all the accessories. And on the left side, we see a quick description of Marvel Spiral. Spiral, Mojo's deadly enforcer, as I said, lieutenant, possesses additional cybernetic limbs, six limbs, six arms, uh, all in all, powerful mystics abilities, and a deep enmity for her former flame, Longshot. So, former flame, lover, Longshot. So... This is Spiral. So before we jump into the actual figure, this is a Heroclix channel. So we have to look at some Heroclix figures of Spiral that we have. And we begin with the oldest one that we have, which is Spiral from, I don't know what set this is. Fantastic Forces, I guess. Uh, set number 92. Spiral, Minions of Doom, Team Ability at 56 points. So we can see uh, her six arms and six swords here. She's wearing blue armor in this case. Okay. She, she has flurry and blades, rightfully so. Toughness and battle fury. So I think this is very thematic to what Spiral can do and of course zero range so a close combat swords blades claws fangs uh figure that can flurry yeah okay so this uncarded as i said golden age and the next time spiral returned to hero clicks was during the wolverine and the x-men set and here she is okay so now donning uh light blue armor costume okay closer to the marvel legends uh color scheme okay so and we can see her very dynamic pose here has an axe only four swords here uh -huh. and then a scarab for the sword and then here's the dial set number 106 106.7 point set number 41 rather okay she has a range of six and pacing teleport. That's in connection to her mystic abilities. Um, pulse wave, energy, energy shield deflection, and probability control. So uh, not so much a representation of her blades, but more of mystic cal powers. Let's take a look at her card. So Spiral is Brotherhood of Mutants, Freedom Force, Mojoverse, Mystical, Robot, and X-Force keywords now she is a rare from the set so and she has a trait dimensional portal gives spiral a double power action 
remove all gateway markers from the map and place two gateway markers on the map. Place one in an adjacent square and the other may be placed in any square on the map. Friendly characters may treat squares with gateway markers as adjacent to each other for movement purposes. Okay, so uh, I think that's very powerful even as a double power action. Okay, you can uh, basically teleport everyone from any place in the map. Okay, they can, they can move through your portals. Okay, so the very much uh, a good team ability. And then, okay, he she also has a special attack power down the dial, which is six arm menace. Spiral can use Blades, Claws, Fangs, and Flurry. So that's a reflection of uh, her swordmanship skills. And when she uses Blade, Claws, Fangs, you may reroll the D6 roll once per turn. That's nice. You're making sure that you maximize the Blades, Claws, Fangs attack. Real name is Rita Wayward. Significance appearance is long shot number one, 1985. Okay, so I'm a bit curious of that Blades Claw dial. It comes in at click number 5 with combat reflexes and shape change. Uh, so she moves from a somewhat range character, uh, teleporting people to, uh, what you call this, to a close range, close combat, in your face, charge flurry. Blades Claws Fang Combat Reflexes character. Okay, I like it. For 106 points, I think she can carry her weight uh, in the game. Okay, so that's Spiral from Wolverine and the X-Men. And uh, finally, the last Spiral and the latest Spiral would be from the X-Men, the animated series, Dark Phoenix Saga set. Okay, here she is. And unfortunately... <laughs> She lost her swords um, for this set. Okay, so they did not include uh, in the dial the swords. Okay, so... But she is coming out of a portal as you can see here. Okay, still donning the light blue uh, uniform. She, ha she has four ta uh, three targets for range. And then Brotherhood of Mutants and a super rare for the set. Okay, let's take a look at the cards. So set number 41, Brotherhood of Mutants, Freedom Force, Mojo Verse, Celebrity Mystical, Rita Wayward has the trait, my mutant brothers and sisters. Once per turn, when an effect other than clearing removes an action token from Spiral, after resolutions, heal her one click. Yeah, so any free healing is good. She has a special movement, Interdimensional Talent Scout, Facing Teleport and Plasticity, when Spiral uses Facing Teleport and moves 5 squares or less, after resolution, she can use both Incapacitate and TK at no cost in any order. And a special damage power, change the focus to a soft blur or sharpen it to crystal, crystal clarity. Perplex and Prob. So the best, two of the three best support uh, powers rather. Okay, so... X-Men the Animated Series, Long Shot is the Significant Appearance. Okay, so you can see her combat values. 12 with that special movement power to, uh, again, facing teleport and possibly in-cap. Uh -huh. And then in the middle of the dial, she becomes the close combat um Character with flurry and blades and close combat ex combat reflexes rather, and gaining that special damage power of perplex and prob, and then she switches back to the facing teleport character. So you can somewhat see a uh, what you call this a mirror. Okay, you can somewhat see uh, that the end. If you look at the dial from the front. And then from the back, from the last click, you can see that they somewhat mirror each other, merging together on click number four. Okay, although the values here are two damage, okay, whereas here three damage on the first two clicks. But other than that, 
the dial is symmetrical. That's the term, symmetrical. <laughs> okay, so that is spiral. And these are the three spirals that we have. I think these are all the spirals in Hero Heroclix so far. None of these are modern at the moment. So probably in the next X-Men set, I hope we get a spiral. Although she haven't played a big role in the House of X, Power of X, and all of the recent Krakoa phase of, of the X-Men. But um, it's always nice to hope for a new spiral figure. Anyway, so let's jump into unboxing the Marvel Legends figure. As always, we're not going to keep the cardboard anyway. But we'll try to take her out as cleanly and quietly as we can. Okay, so the best figure of 2022, arguably, do you agree or not? Maybe comment on the, uh, comment your thoughts and why do you think she is the best if you agree. And if you don't agree, what do you think is the best figure of released by Marvel Legends 2022? Okay. okay. She has one, two, three, four, five, six accessories. Always a good start. And we have two extra arms. Always a great addition. And of course, the figure itself. Let's see. Okay. So, uh, I guess what makes this character one of the great great release for 2022 is how they were able to really implement the six arms it's going to be hard to implement something like this okay so all arms are tight tight knees are tight feet are tight head is tight body type is tight <laughs> so that spiral let's see we have here this would be the closest of uh, Heroclix figure. So let's try to um, pose her like this one. Let's see. It's gonna be challenging. Uh, we only need one, two, three swords. Okay, let's get two katanas and one big ass sword. For now. Oops, sorry. Let's get this big sword and yeah, the axe as well. Okay. okay, so let's see. So two hands are holding one sword. Uh, the top hands. Let's see. Okay. I think the detail should be each of the hands should only have like three fingers. Okay. Uh, if, if that's that's the comic accurate, I think for Spiral. But I guess it's going to be hard to implement in Marvel Legends because... Uh, hands tend to be reused okay so we have the swords like this one on, on top on top of head okay top of head let's see there you go and then we have the middle hand oops sorry I just noticed I don't know two hands are Let's see, oh, there, there's two hands carrying the, holding the axe. So two hands holding the axe. Might be a very heavy axe or she wants to have full force on this axe. Okay. This should have been a, a battle axe. Okay, this axe looks generic or smaller. And then the last two hands are holding swords. Okay. Mm hmm okay this one's holding a sword here okay and the other one is holding it a little tilted so we have to put replace the hand the cybernetic hand with an open cybernetic hand let's do that let her hold the sword 
okay and the knees a little bent ready to slash the opponent and take a look at that okay tilted head a little to the left So we have the comparison, Marvel Legends, and Heroclix figure. It's hard to argue that this is not one of the best figures of 2022 because of all the dynamic poses you can do with six arms that are well built. So yeah, I would agree this is, this might be the best of 2022. Okay, so thank you very much for watching, guys. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.